how to downgrade the Poco F3 or the Mi 11X or the Redmi K40 from MIUI 12.5 to MIUI 12. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can downgrade your Poco F3, Mi 11X, Redmi K40 from MIUI 12.5 to MIUI 12. Now, why would you want to downgrade? One of the reasons is you do not like MIUI 12.5. Another reason could be that the custom ROM you want to flash wants you to be on, say, MIUI 12.0.5 firmware and the final reason is personal preference of course now what are the prerequisites for this video well for starters you need to have an unlocked bootloader and then you also need to have twrp recovery installed videos for both of those can be found in the description of this video and before i forget i do have the poco f3 which is running miui 12.5.1 based on android 11 However, the process will work even if you are having or even if you own the Mi 11X or the Redmi K40. They are just the same devices with different names sold in different regions. Next thing you need to make sure is that your battery is charged at least 50 to 60%. Do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30%. Another important thing to note over here is that you are going to lose all your pictures, videos, anything important which you have on your device. So make sure you have a backup of all those things. A lot of people will ask me, can we do this without a format data? The answer to that is feel free to try. I personally do not recommend that because you might run into issues and boot loops. So whenever I downgrade, I prefer to have a clean flash. Next up, what are the files which you need? Now, all the files which you need are linked in the description of this video. So for starters, let me open file manager and we can change the view a little, go into the download folder. So this here is the file which you need. So this is the recovery ROM for my variant of the Mi 11X, in this case the Pogo F3. So you need to know what device you have. You have Mi 11X or Poco F3 and then download the recovery ROM. Again, download the full recovery ROM for your variant of the Mi 11X or the Poco F3. Do not download the incremental OTA update or the fast boot ROM. So this is the only file which you need. Next up, we can go into settings and then we can go into password and security, remove your screen lock, fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done, go back, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done, go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your Google account. Why are we removing all the accounts and security measures? We are doing this because we are going from one ROM to another and I don't want you to be locked out of your own device and another important thing the file which i am using right now is 12.0.5.0 so once the downgrade process has finished we should be back to 12.0.5.0 from 12.5.1 now another super important thing you are going to lose root and all your modules so everything will be lost device will be as good as new next up we need to boot into our recovery so turn off your device and then press and hold power and volume up together till you see the recovery logo another pro tip is as soon as you feel the vibration you can let go of the power button so i felt the vibration let go of the power button keep volume up pressed and it should boot into twrp recovery so here it is we have booted into twrp recovery go into wipe advanced wipe select dalvik and data that's it select only dalvik and data and then swipe to wipe once that is done tap on the home button go into install now you need to navigate to the folder where you have the miui 12 recovery flashable rom for the poco f3 or the mi 11 x in case you downloaded it on your phone directly it will be in the download folder and here is the file all you need to do is select the file and then if you want to keep twrp make sure this option is checked again make sure the option of inject twrp after install is checked and once that is done swipe to confirm flash so as you can see everything was flashed without any issues here it is the rom was flashed and then the recovery was also flashed so twrp is not replaced next up tap on the home button going to reboot and then select recovery 
So as you can see, we do have the team win logo and do note it takes around 10 to 15 seconds for it to boot back into your TWRP recovery. You will have a black screen for around 10 seconds. So do not panic. Anyways, we will go into wipe format data here in type yes again do note that format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right of the keyboard so as you can see format data finished without any errors but there are some errors about unable to mount some partitions those can be ignored and we can tap on the home button go into reboot and select system and there it is we do have the miui boot animation on our poco f3 and as you can see this is the miui 12 boot animation which means we are booting into miui 12 on the poco f3 or the mi 11x the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen of miui 12 let me skip the initial setup real quick and the brightness is a bit light here it is back on deck let us go into settings about phone miui version 12.0.5.0 based on android 11 installed without any issues on the poco f3 we can also check if twrp recovery is still there so again turn off your device and then press and hold power and volume up together till you see the recovery logo or you can also let go of the power button once you feel the vibration and bam here it is twrp recovery is still intact which means we are good to go and flash our custom ROMs and there it is peeps that is how you downgrade your POCO F3 or the Mi 11X or the Redmi K40 from Mi UI 12.5 to Mi UI 12 and also keep your custom recovery and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when I see you